Hey there guys, welcome to Robocraft, where we're on the CRF for another bot review with a bot that I have just been charged twice for. Yes, the lovely internet gods that control my internet have decided they didn't want to let me connect to the server, so it came up straight away with the lease on this bot has expired. Do you like to re redo it for seven days? Um, well, I'd already just hired it like 10 seconds beforehand, so why is it just suddenly run out? And then I have to re-rent it, and it costs me another 370,000 RP, which with my internet problems is not coming very easily at the moment. But we are here today to have a look at Abomination 4.5 by Liatian, which... Why have you put the rudders in a cage for? What did they do wrong? It's okay, I will free you. Free the caged rudders. Mark 8, nice. Um, it's, it's very, it's got a lot of thrust. It's got a hell of a lot of thrust, top and bottom. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Good six spread of R with the old plasma. That's very nice. It's, um, it's rather weird. I'm not quite sure. I'm not I'm not quite sure with it if I like the style but personal taste and all that jazz isn't it anyway here's a little bit of blurb reads a very tanky yet decently agile bumper bumper let's start that again shall we a very tanky yet decently agile bomber has lots of triforcing good redundancy and hidden vertical steering thrusters um, Wow okay they certainly are hidden because I definitely can't see them um, one thing you haven't got is any jammers. I've noticed a lot with these bots. You don't tend to be putting jammers on your bots, guys. Oh, electronic warfare is the way forwards. If you can stay hidden and stealthy and then get a surprise attack on your enemies, that's what you want. Says the guy who's got no stealth or spatial awareness. Anyway. <laughs> right. Enough waffling. Let's get straight in it. I'll be in it. Yeah, we are in it. Good. We should be in it. I've just been charged twice for it. Anyway, into a TDM, guys. Okay guys, it's thrown us into a battle class 6 to 7. Got a rail over here. And we got a medic, and we got an SMG, and we got another rail, and another medic, and another rail. And we're missing a medic. Okay, let's go. Ow! Really, medic? Is that how this is going to start? Wow! Wow! It's like a little fat bumblebee. Oh, no vertical rudder. Please give me vertical rudder. Please vertical rudder. Oh shit, we've been spotted. Hi, Mr. Rail Hover. Oh, hello, Mr. Rail Line over there. Whee! Whee! Hey, who said you could shoot at me? Um. Oh sh! That rail has managed to take out both one side of my rear thrusters completely. I'm I'm screwed. Thanks, medic. You're the greatest. But there's another one shooting at me. Oh, crying out loud. The hell is a team actually playing at? I want to go down that way, you stupid bot. Oh, really? Come on. Sorry, guys. Got a little cough framing going on. Right, let's thank the medics. I can't because I've got no chat. Oh, grand! And now I can't get out of the chat. And now I'm out of the chat. Crying out loud. <coughs> oh, blimey. Got something in my throat giving me a little tickle. I want that freaking rail that's over here. Where have you gone, bish? 
see your bloody rail line. Where are you? There you are. Really? Zero? Oh! <laughs> That's what you get for shooting at me, sunshine. Another one gone. Come on. Have some for you. Some for you. Some more for you. And we're down. I can't do nothing. I'm trapped. Ah, oh, well, we got rubbish team as usual. Come on, just get it over with. Yay! Took a few shots to kill me, that's not bad. Well guys, we got destroyed unfortunately. Um, so, how are we going to rate this spot? Style wise, I'm going to give you four stars for style because it's not your average bomber. It doesn't it's not quite my cup of tea but then it's not like all the others it, it is different it does have its own unique style combat um i don't know i think we're gonna have to leave you on three stars um we did get a couple of kills and it does take damage fairly well but it is very heavy and although it is very agile, a vertical rudder would m just help it out just that little bit. Um, I also feel that your thrust needs to be, some of it needs to be inside the bot so it's saved completely, not just all on the outside. So we're going to submit those scores. And um, yeah, if you could, I'm not sure if you could get the thrust on the inside anywhere. It looks rather. It's very triforce and stuff in there but we did lose one set of rudders clean off of one side at the back it's another reason for your three stars and um, then we had little to no control but we will jump into another game and we will definitely try our best to get a victory out of it guys okay and it's put us in guys we have got three medics this time and a battle class six to eight so here we go with our tier seven our Mark 7 armor and our Mark 7 thrusters and our Mark 8 rudders. I'm not sure on the plasma what mark they are. It, it does fly pretty nicely, but with a lot of these small square flyers, the wings are so close together that if you get a shot in the wrong place, you lose a lot of your flight control. Haha, <laughs> bish. Oh. Missed him. Did miss him though. All that time. I don't care, I don't care, I want that medic. Oh. Go away. Yeah, I got him. Blimey. It does take a fair amount of damage, but it... Oh, really? No one's going to bother spotting him. For fuck's sake, you're shooting at him and you still don't bother spotting him. Oh, and now we've got only one rudder on one side and it's a pain in the ass to freaking drive. Oh, look, and now we're getting shot. Yeah, it's a bit pointless now, guys, considering I'm dead. 
If you'd healed me up properly in the first place, I wouldn't be in this situation. There's absolutely nothing I can do. Absolutely nothing I can do. Hmm. Not sure about this spot, guys. Not sure. With the old double rudder set up, you're relying on double rudders all the time. The minute you lose one rudder, you've lost lift on that side. I just don't know about this one, guys. I want it to. I want it to do well. I like. I want all the bots that I test to do well, but sometimes they just don't, and I don't. Oh, I don't like being negative about them. I mean, this one takes off nicely, it does its old rolls, it's, mm, it's, I think it, it's too heavy. Unfortunately, with the way they've made the game, if you put any weight on the end of the wings or outside the wings, it really upsets the balance of the craft that's flying. But then they've made the hitboxes so freaking big that you can't have a wing sticking out of the body. So it's a catch-22 situation. Do you armour up the wings and make your bot stupidly heavy so it doesn't really control that well? Or do you take the risk and have your rudders sticking out so they've got maximum turning capabilities? If you get my meaning. Nobody's bloody spotting. Oh, well done, son. You're dead now because you didn't bother spotting him. Great. You know what? I'll just fly over here and I'll spot everyone and you just do nothing, yeah guys? Kill still. Haha. <laughs> oh, hello. Oh, I missed him. See, he, he ran the risk of putting his wings outside. Oh, you bastards. Haha. 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 Right, this bot's not doing too badly at the moment. But it would help if people were spotting. Got him. Got him. I've got a medic chasing me now. And a plasma bomber. Should have moved, Mr. Rail. Too little, too late, Mr. Rail. I've got half a bot left. One more shot and I'm dead. Oh, medic. I love you. Oh, I missed him. Missed him again. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, come on, guys. Ha ha, I killed you, bish. Alright, where's the other one? Oh, mate. Yes, team victory. And look how much bot we got left. Four kills for a score. Look at that. Finally. Nice bit of damage. Nice four kills. And a quick look at how much bot we've got left. <laughs> okay, okay. I take it back. You can have an extra half star for combat. So you can have three and a half stars for combat because that last game, it took damage in the right places, I want to say. And we got four kills out of it, so that's not bad going, actually. 
So guys, this was Abomination 4.5 by Laia Tian. Anyway guys, if you've liked what you've seen today, if you can click the like button for us, helps me out, helps the channel out, and shows that these CRF bot reviews are popular. If you've got any comments or messages or suggestions, if you want to drop them down below or send it through to the channel, I will do my best to get back to you. But um, until the next one guys, see you later.